When I found out I was pregnant, my immediate thoughts were, I can't keep this baby. There's no way, I'm still living my life, I'm going to college, I can't continue this pregnancy, there's absolutely no way. So we had an appointment set with Planned Parenthood to abort this baby because that's the only choice that I thought that I had. Oh, sorry, hold on. I was trying not to get emotional. Each year in the United States, over 900,000 tiny human beings have tragically lost their lives to abortion violence. In Idaho alone, abortion has ended the lives of nearly 1,600 preborn children every year. Thankfully, Roe has been overturned and the people of Idaho have built a wall of protection around women and children here in our state. On principle, that's a very good thing just like laws that ended slavery and segregation. But laws alone don't always fix or solve the complex issues and situations surrounding human rights. It's a starting point, but we must go deeper and offer better solutions than the world has to offer. We must address the deeply held concerns people have regarding abortion. We have to re-engage a culture that has embraced abortion violence as normal and acceptable. We must show and live out the standard not only for truth, but for love, compassion, quality care, and tangible support. In other words, we must be exceptional in the compassionate care we provide. Through our unflinching and consistent example, we will prove one woman at a time that every woman deserves better than abortion. So has the pro-life community crossed the proverbial finish line because Roe was overturned? Not even close. Stanton Healthcare is needed more than ever and as leading experts in unexpected pregnancy care, we stand ready to meet the needs of women. We don't turn a blind eye to the reality of the difficulties women face. 50 years of unfettered access to abortion hasn't solved the challenges women face or fixed broken systems. In fact, the exact opposite happened. In that 50 years, there has been no significant drop in domestic violence, drug use, homelessness, or poverty. And in some cases, there has been a significant increase in those societal challenges. Abortion has not solved any social problems or empowered women. We are now at the starting line. It's a new day and a fresh start for this emerging generation. And together, this is our moment to shine. To ensure that every woman facing an unexpected pregnancy has access to life-affirming quality care, tangible resources, and compassionate support. And to continue expanding our community of hope. I'm Brandi Swindell, CEO and founder of Stanton Healthcare. We couldn't be more excited to have you join us in expanding our community of hope for women facing unexpected pregnancies and for you to hear firsthand from the women we serve. Their stories are a direct result of how your support has a positive and lasting impact on their lives and the lives of their children. Together, we will continue to ensure that women have access to compassionate, life-affirming medical care, tangible resources, and hope. My name is Caitlin. I am from Nampa. Back in my early 20s, I found myself, in a sense, rebelling and wanting to do things that I never got to do. I wanted to go out and party and found out halfway through the summer after my second year of college that I had become pregnant. My immediate thoughts were, I can't keep this baby. There's no way. I'm still living my life. I'm going to college. I'm too young. I'm single. My mom is the first one that I told about the pregnancy and immediately we went through the steps in trying to schedule an abortion. Oh, sorry, hold on. Let's try not to get emotional. So we had an appointment set with Planned Parenthood to abort this baby because that's the only choice that I thought that I had. 
Basically, the only option that they did give me was an abortion. They didn't offer any sort of pregnancy assistance. They didn't offer adoption service assistance, nothing. They just basically said, yeah, you're here for an abortion, let's do it. The night before my abortion appointment, my mom stayed up all night just praying and hoping that there was some other answer that would come to her. Upon her Googling and searching, she came across Stanton. We were literally on our way to the abortion appointment. She called the number that she found associated with Stanton Healthcare, got the voicemail. So left a voicemail and just said, hey, my daughter's pregnant and we're on our way to an abortion appointment right now. Just wanted to see if there's any other options. We got to the parking lot of Planned Parenthood as we were getting ready to go into the appointment. Angie with Stanton called my mom when Angie's voicemail came in, we were sitting in our vehicle in the parking lot right in front of Planned Parenthood because we were getting ready to go into my appointment that I had set for the abortion. Hi, Caitlin. This is Angie Dwyer calling from Stanton Healthcare. I received your message and I wanted to let you know that we're in the office right now and we'd love to see you. If you're right next door, it's a quick stroll to our office. So just head on over in here and I'd love to see you. Talk to you soon, honey. Bye-bye. To think that I was one missed voicemail away from continuing with this abortion haunts me. I wouldn't be the same person that I am today and I wouldn't have the beautiful 10 year old that I do today and I wouldn't have this amazing life. I was only about six weeks. It was early enough to where it was just a little bean in there. We got to do an ultrasound. We got to see the baby. We got to hear the heartbeat, which then the emotions started all over again. Seeing that little life inside of me that I didn't realize was already so viable, was already so important. I just knew immediately that I had made the right decision. This memory seems like it's fresh because it was such an amazing experience but my son just turned 10 in March. But Stanton has still been very much a huge part of my life. I am actually still working with Stanton now that I'm expecting my second child. I have been able to go and see this baby develop as well. Already it's just been an amazing opportunity to still be able to, to have this option. He just started fifth grade today, so he's growing up way too fast. Connor is such a sweet boy. He's just so fun and so random. It keeps you on your toes, definitely. He was mine. I am now a mommy. I get to raise this little boy, be the best example that I can be for him. I was just so, so overwhelmed and just so happy and so satisfied that I had made the decisions that I did. From the moment a woman steps through our doors and is greeted by our warm and professional staff, to the experience of being genuinely heard and seen when she sits down with her client advocate, who is equipped to offer life-honoring guidance, empathy, and practical help, to that miraculous, nothing compares to it moment of meeting her baby on ultrasound, hearing her baby's heartbeat for the first time, and the natural bond she's been feeling is solidified, she becomes protective of her growing baby. To all the follow-up care visits and crafting of an individualized wellness plan, our volunteers and staff ensure each woman encounters the lasting love and hope of Christ. Through your support, every woman we serve experiences the joy and reality of an entire community of hope that surrounds her on the beautiful journey of motherhood. I'm Samantha Doty, Physician Assistant and Director of Clinical Services at Stanton Healthcare. Our licensed, third-party accredited pregnancy medical clinic in Meridian, Idaho sits just steps away from the Planned Parenthood that used to perform 75% of all abortions in Idaho. With Idaho's protective pro-life laws, thousands of women are experiencing a welcome reprieve from the pressure to go through with an unwanted abortion, and they are searching for hope-filled alternatives. 
Many women are still unaware of the compassionate care and services that Stanton provides at no charge, so we had to find a way to reach them. Over the summer, we launched our largest ever client-centered outreach campaign with beautiful eye-catching billboards, powerful radio ads, and targeted digital media ads online. More than half of all abortions are now completed with abortion pills. I'm Samantha Doty, physician assistant with Stanton Healthcare. If you've taken the first abortion pill and had a change of heart, there's still hope. Prior to taking the second set of pills, which are intended to complete the abortion, call us right away. At Stanton Healthcare, you'll receive exceptional medical care and an eligibility evaluation for our abortion pill reversal protocol. Call 844-324-CARE or visit stantonhealthcare.org. Our Stanton Healthcare clinics are busier than at any other time in our 17 year history, with an increase of 67% in client visits. And most importantly, the women who are at greatest risk of an abortion, they're finding us and they're choosing life for their babies. Through your generous support, we are actively expanding our community of hope to women facing unexpected pregnancies. I'm Linda Thomas, Director of Community Outreach with Stanton Healthcare. When Roe v. Wade was overturned, Planned Parenthood knew they would no longer be able to sell abortions in the state of Idaho. They quickly and explicitly stated their goal to continue their Idaho abortion business just across state lines in Ontario, Oregon. Stanton Healthcare's response? On the very first day their abortion facility opened in Ontario, we rolled in with our third-party accredited, state-of-the-art, 37-foot mobile medical clinic, ready to provide outstanding medical care, resources, and unwavering support to the women of Idaho and Oregon. God has abundantly blessed these efforts through the generous support of individuals, churches, and businesses and through an entire team of dedicated volunteers and staff to make this critical outreach possible. Just recently, Kylie, one of our Stanton, Ontario clients, shared, Stanton has been a tremendous help and resource during the last several months. Their compassionate staff is always a joy to sit down and talk with, just as much as it is a joy to have the opportunity to see my growing baby on ultrasound. In such a small area, these services Stanton provides are life-changing. Our God-given vision at Stanton Healthcare is to replace Planned Parenthood. In addition to our Idaho clinics, we currently have affiliate locations in Southern California, Michigan, as well as internationally in Northern Ireland and Scotland. Lord willing, we believe there will be many more Stanton Healthcare locations to come and we ask for you to join us in faith-filled prayer for this vision. In this new post row America, God has given Stanton a clear two-pronged strategy. The first and most critical is providing exceptional, compassionate care for women facing unexpected pregnancies. The second is to make abortion unthinkable while also building a culture that values and celebrates motherhood fatherhood, and the life of every preborn baby. Through our Stanton Public Policy Center, based in Washington, D.C., we passionately work to educate lawmakers on both sides of the aisle. We engage with the media as an uncompromising voice for life, and we hold prayer and worship gatherings as we cry out to God for His intervention. This past January, we brought three of our Stanton moms and their children, all saved from abortion, to Washington, D.C. for the March for Life. While there, these brave moms launched our national Not Fake to Me campaign in response to pro-abortion politicians, media, and the abortion industry who falsely labeled life-affirming centers as fake clinics. These are real women with real stories, sharing with lawmakers and the media on Capitol Hill about the quality medical care and lasting support they have received at Stanton. Perhaps most touching of all is that Stanton baby Paulina, now 15 years old, was determined to use her own voice, courageously telling lawmakers, I am very real. 
These are women that God is raising up with powerful testimonies no one can refute. Your support is a vital part of the impact Stanton has in our culture and in the lives of the women and children we serve. My childhood was kind of rough. My mom died when I was six, and my dad went to jail when I was about 13 years old. My name's Alicia. I have a daughter. She's seven years old. After I had my daughter, I was seeing some doctors. They basically told me that, you know, we don't think you can have any more kids. I found out I was pregnant, was in complete shock. The dad was very excited at first. I later found out on Christmas Day that he was engaged to somebody. He wanted me to get an abortion or um, give the baby up for adoption. Those I felt like were my only options. I heard about Stanton through a friend. I contacted them, went into their office, and I met my client advocate. I was extremely nervous, but I was met with a lot of like grace and love. When they did the ultrasound, the baby was sucking its thumb, kicking around, literally. It was the craziest thing, and it's just the like, size of this little pea. It just made me realize like this child is so alive and healthy and well. It just really puts into perspective, this is life, you know? And how can you take that away from somebody? Throughout the uh, pregnancy, I needed so much support. As far as like maternity clothes, they offered counseling, they did prenatal massage, things like that. That was just like extremely helpful. My client advocate reached out to me immediately after he was born and she dropped off food one time, made sure I had diapers, dropped off clothes. She has been just a huge support system along the way to help me thrive and be the best mom that I can be. The baby's awesome, <laughs> uh, it's a boy. I never knew that I needed a son. I always said like I could have six daughters and be the happiest person on earth, but something about this baby boy, sorry, he is so special. Definitely God knew that I needed him. Sorry, um, he is just like the sweetest person. I can't explain it. He just like, God knew that I needed this baby boy. I would tell other women that they should go to Stanton for help um, if they even have a thought in their mind that they um, want to end their pregnancy or that they need support because they're there for them to support them and help them and, and guide them to make the right decision. My Gratitude to every supporter is huge. In fact, I look at his face every single day and I'm just so thankful for every single person who has given to this organization because he wouldn't be here if it wasn't for them. I'm Leela Afoa, Executive Director of Stanton Healthcare. I'm here at our beautiful Stanton Wellness Center in Boise, Idaho. The Wellness Center is part of our holistic approach where many of the ongoing services we provide take place. Our trained client advocates create an individualized wellness plan for each expecting mom that lasts a minimum of 18 months and addresses her unique needs, physically, mentally, and spiritually. These plans begin at our Stanton Medical Clinic with follow-up visits, personalized care, and advocacy sessions. Stanton Wellness, our client care continues, ranging from practical needs like maternity clothing, baby supplies, and community resources, to childbirth education classes, prenatal licensed massage therapy, parenting education classes, lactation consultations, certified life coaching, and mentorship, along with special visits to our gorgeous Stanton Baby Boutique with hand-sewn items and so much more. In addition, we extend Christ's love to women and men experiencing the pain and regret of a past abortion. Through our after abortion care and recovery, we offer healing retreats and individual or group sessions to women and healing resources for men. At Stanton, we want everyone who walks through our doors to find hope and be well.
I've helped moms, they come in not knowing anything about childbirth, or they come in having questions, wondering what is going to happen. I'm scared. My name is Faith Boyd. I'm a volunteer RN with Stanton Healthcare. I help facilitate specifically the childbirth classes. It's a seven week class that empowers the mom. She walks out of that feeling more in the know of what's happening, not only with her body and how God blessed her to make a baby, but how to talk to her medical providers in a way that she has heard and understood and is able to make informed decisions. Every day we help moms in different ways, whether that's someone walking in asking for diapers or clothing, or someone walking in saying, hey, I have a question about this medical procedure that they want me to do um, involving my baby. And just answering their questions, alleviating some of those fears. Sometimes it's just a simple, it's okay. Everything's gonna be all right. People reach out to me to volunteer at Stanton because they have a heart for our ministry. They have a heart for moms and babies and they want to be involved. I'm Nanette Regis and I'm the volunteer coordinator at Stanton Healthcare. We love our volunteers at Stanton. Because of our volunteers, we are able to provide so many services at so many different locations. Our Boise Women's Wellness Center is 99% of volunteers. We literally couldn't have the doors open without them here. One of the most vital roles that you can have as a volunteer doesn't require much time commitment at all. We encourage everyone to learn about Stanton Healthcare and the services that we provide and share that message with people that you meet. The majority of the women that walk into Stanton Healthcare learned about Stanton Healthcare through another individual. We call these our Stanton Ambassadors. We invite you to become a Stanton Ambassador, learn all you can about Stanton Healthcare and share the message. Over the past year, Stanton Wellness has remained open to provide exceptional care for all women of the Treasure Valley. A stark contrast with the Boise Planned Parenthood that used to be right next door. They permanently closed their doors as soon as abortions could no longer be performed. Stanton Healthcare, on the other hand, is continuing to expand the services and care we offer to each woman, both during and after her pregnancy. With your support, we are expanding our community of hope. Abortion is still with us. Abortion pills have become the preferred method for abortion providers like Planned Parenthood, making the deadly procedure even more accessible and resulting in a much higher profit margin for their abortion business. Young girls and women are often underinformed and even deceived about the reality of chemical abortion pills. They are marketed as simple and safe. While this method may seem less invasive than a surgical abortion, it is equally deadly to the preborn baby and is often more traumatic for the mother. In fact, it is not uncommon for women to experience regrets immediately after taking the first abortion pill. That's why Stanton Healthcare offers the life-saving option of abortion pill reversal. Stanton has seen five babies born so far after their mothers began the chemical abortion pill process. Our volunteers and staff have seen firsthand the trauma that results from women being pressured to take these chemical abortion pills and then the pain, regret, and fear they endure after taking the first pill. We have also witnessed the immense relief and overwhelming joy a woman feels when she gets to see her baby's heartbeat on ultrasound. One of our Stanton moms described this feeling as raw hope. That's what you're providing when you support Stanton. Real and lasting hope that saves lives. With your support, we expect the number of lives saved to continue increasing as we unite to raise awareness about the life-saving option of abortion pill reversal. The tender love of God is on full display in the lives of the women we serve. It is deeply moving and undeniable. These women come from diverse backgrounds with unique stories, and when they come to Stanton, they all found something that was in their words, life-changing and life-saving they found a community of hope. Thank you to our Stanton moms for bravely sharing your stories. Whether it's been more than a decade, as it is with Caitlin and Connor, or coming through our doors just this past year for Alicia and her baby boy Steele. 
Every mom and baby becomes part of the Stanton family forever. And it's our partnership with you, our dear friends and supporters, that will sustain us in expanding our community of hope to even more women and their babies. This past year, 233 Stanton babies were born and 159 are currently due. And each one represents not only a child, but an individual woman and a family whose lives have been touched and transformed by your generosity. The legacy and the generations touched by you is innumerable. At Stanton Healthcare, we celebrate the value and uniqueness of each mother, each father, and each child. Together, through God's grace and provision, we transform lives and strengthen families. Expanding our community of hope for women facing unexpected pregnancies is something we cannot do without you. Will you prayerfully consider the largest financial gift possible to help us meet the increased demand for our compassionate medical services and ongoing wellness care? In sharp contrast to abortion businesses like Planned Parenthood, who receive hundreds of millions of taxpayer dollars every year, Stanton exists solely through your generous financial support as individuals, churches, businesses, and community organizations who choose to partner with us. And don't forget, we provide all our services at no charge to ensure every woman facing an unexpected pregnancy has access to exceptional care. I'd like to share some powerful ways you can provide help and hope to the women we serve who will walk through our doors tomorrow, next week, next month, and even next year. $77 will provide a woman with a lab-grade pregnancy test and life-affirming care with our trained client advocates and medical personnel, helping her to see her own worth and the worth of her child. $727 is the average cost of one abortion, resulting in the tragic death of a preborn child and ongoing heartache and regret for countless mothers. A donation of $727 to Stanton Healthcare provides two women who are struggling with the pain of a past abortion the opportunity to attend one of our after-abortion healing retreats at no charge, a truly priceless gift. $727 will also provide one woman with a lab-grade pregnancy test, an ultrasound exam, and follow-up wellness sessions with our trained client advocates and medical personnel as she prepares for the birth of her baby. And because of matching grants, your gift of $9,134 will provide five women with 18 months of individualized medical and wellness care, starting with a pregnancy test, ultrasound exam, and life-affirming options counseling, all the way through her pregnancy with follow-up visits by licensed professionals certified in childbirth education classes, parenting preparation, lactation consultations, nutritional advice, pre- and postnatal massage therapy, life coaching sessions, and spiritual and wellness care. And other fun things like shopping in our Stanton Baby Boutique, receiving essential baby supplies, and baby's first birthday gift box and photo shoot. All of this is provided at no charge to five Stanton moms like Caitlin and Alicia through your generous donation of $9,134. Please prayerfully consider the largest gift possible to help Stanton as we enter this new season of serving more women than ever, resulting in more lives saved, families strengthened, and Lord willing, our culture transformed to one that embraces and protects every life. There are three easy ways to give. Scan the QR code on the screen, visit stantongala.com and click donate, or mail a check with gala in the memo line to Stanton Healthcare, 2176 East Franklin Road, Suite 130, Meridian, Idaho, 83642. Your gift of any size will be put to immediate use in our Idaho clinics. And there is no gift that is too small or too big. We steward every penny wisely and efficiently. And please spread the word about who we are and what we do. We trust God to powerfully provide. And through your generosity and prayers, we are expanding our community of hope. There are three easy ways to give. Scan the QR code on the screen.
visit stantongala.com and click donate. Or mail a check with Gala in the memo line to Stanton Healthcare 2176 East Franklin Road, Suite 130, Meridian, Idaho 83642. Thank you to our generous 2023 Gala sponsors for expanding our community of hope.